the British Marines Youth Reporter. I'll be talking to people about what jobs they do in the marine industry. My name's Charlie. I'm a skipper for passenger boats up and down the River Thames. My name is Lisa Caddick. My name's Dean Drake. And I work as a boat sales broker. I work for Thames Clippers and I am one of their marine engineers. How many skips can you do in two minutes? Not very many, I'm afraid. I was never very good at skipping, but I'm a skipper, which is the same as being a captain. You're a broker. Does that mean you get paid to break things? Because if it does, <laughs> then I would love to do your job. No, I'm afraid it doesn't. I can see why you would think that, but we definitely, definitely shouldn't be breaking things. We need to be able to look after people's boats so that we can sell them in the best condition they can be in. What does a marine engineer actually do? They're responsible for keeping the boat running. You don't want a boat that's going to break down on you. So we look after the engines, the gearboxes, all the GPS and all the gadgets that are up on the bridge as well. Then what makes you a good skipper? I can handle a boat without crashing into anything and keeping the passengers all happy and smiling. We look at it and say, if you'd like a boat, then we want to know exactly what it is about a boat that you want. Like, what do you want to do on it? Do you want to sleep on it? Do you want to go on the river? Do you want to go to France? And then we make sure we can find that boat and offer it to you and say, this is perfect for what you need. So can girls be marine engineers? Definitely. I work with a girl engineer. She's very good, maybe a little bit better than me. Can you teach me how to tie a knot? We could have a go at that. You're really good at selling things, so sell me this pen. Now with your left hand, make a loop. What do you like about the pen? That it doesn't have a lid and you can click it. And I see you've got a clipboard there, so would you like to buy this pen so that you can write some things down? For how much? How about £1.50? If you could lower the price. Lower the more. price? Mm. What made you want to do your job? Were you inspired from young? I was indeed. I used to build Lego, play with Meccano, and I basically enjoyed putting things back together after I'd taken them apart. Why did you want to be a skipper? Well, my dad took me sailing when I was very, very young because I think he was thinking I was watching too much TV. But as soon as we started bobbing around in this little boat, I realised what fun it was. Chewbacca did a lot of engineering for the Millennium Falcon in Star Wars. Do you think you have to be eight feet tall and furry to be an engineer? I don't think you need to be. You'd struggle getting into some of the tight gaps that we have to get into. You'd make an ideal engineer at your size. Oh, thank you. You said 50p and I say £1.50. How about we meet in the middle? £1. OK. Deal. Thank Enjoy you. Enjoy your pen. <laughs> Narrow. Ooh, look, perfect. 